What's going on out there YouTube? Victor S back here with another sneaker unboxing. Today as you can tell we've got some Diodoras. These are from the uh, Sol Rio pack. These are the uh, Packer shoes. <clears throat> I missed out on the Kith ones because they sold out super fast. These were like a plan B for me which is what I wanted anyway. These are the Intrepid Packer shoes. And of course camera doesn't focus. Imagine that. Nine and a half. Uh, forget it. Every time. Doesn't want to focus. Alright, let's get into the shoes. <clears throat> First off here we got like a little uh, a little bag that they give you. A little storage bag I guess. Kind of cool. We got their branding on it. We got some extra laces. We got some white ones. And some rainbow ones. Alright, onto the shoes. Get the box out of the way. All right, there we go. You got one shoe that's got black. Flip it over. Yellow on one side. This side on the outside, it's got red. On the inside, it's got green. Especially for the uh, <clears throat> Olympic rings. All right. On with the shoe here. Primarily black. You got a white midsole and a gum bottom. Gum bottom is really kind of rough. It's like a like a textured type. I don't know. Be good traction at least. But the uh, front here is all suede all through the toe box. You've got leather that comes all the way up around through here. The Diodora logo is also also leather. <clears throat> Go around here to the back <clears throat> where you've got your Packer shoes logo. Can't really tell. It's all leather back through here. And then the heel support here is hard plastic. Um, on the tongue here, this one's red and green. This one over here is like an orange and purple. Can't really see. I haven't even unlaced them yet. Cool thing for me that I thought was pretty neat was the inside. It's got all the flags on it, which I thought was kind of cool. Got a little cushion here for your heel support. Yeah, I thought that was a really cool touch to have all the different flags of all around the world. So yeah, this is a pretty good pickup for me, you know, since the Kith one sold out in like five seconds, which I knew was going to happen. But these, like I said, these were my plan B, and I'm pretty happy with these. I haven't tried them on yet, just actually got them this morning. So, not really sure which laces I'm going to use. I don't know. I guess the multicolor one would probably look best seeing how it's got all the different colors in it. White ones might not look that bad. But for me the gold tip kind of throws it off. But the black ones that come with it, they've got gold tips as well. I don't know why my camera's being so buggy. I won't even focus that great. I don't have a lot of stuff here in the way. So yeah, there's the shoe pretty nice I think it was an easy pickup <clears throat> after the uh, after I lost out on the Kith ones I went right over to the uh, Packer Shoes site and they must have just went live with them or something because I don't know they had tons of tons of sizes maybe uh, maybe it wasn't that big of a hit of a shoe to some people I thought it was pretty cool just put all the extras here in a big pack so you can see them <clears throat> let's get this thing over here which I think is cool. I always like the little extras that come with the stuff. You know, I like the little bags that they give out. You know, one pair I got it came with olive oil and about five different laces, which I think is cool. But yep, this is the uh, this is the Packer shoes, uh, Diadora Sol de Rio. So, I mean, it's a pretty good cop if you can get them. Um, I don't know. Comment down below. Let me know which uh, which laces you think would go good. Keep them black. Maybe the multicolor ones. Maybe the white ones. The white ones might give it a clean look. You never really know. Let me know in the comments. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe for uh, other shoe unboxings. Thanks.